Yeah, I'm not going to the car boot this morning. <laughs> Hi everyone and welcome to this video. Well, as you just saw, my <laughs> first Sunday as a reseller hasn't gone very well. The door handle came off my apartment as I left the apartment this morning. So unfortunately, um, because my partner's at the gym, I had to stay here and guard the flat because if the door closed, we wouldn't be able to get back in again because <laughs> you can't pull the door and the other side doesn't open the latch. So yeah, that's my Sunday. I just thought I'd give you a quick update on how things are going since it's been 24 hours since my eBay shop has been online. So far, it's, what is it at the moment? It's coming up to nine o'clock in the morning on Sunday. I've sold four things, so I'm gonna show you what I've sold so far. I'm really happy to have sold some items in the short space I've been open. So this is my eBay shop as it stands on Sunday. Uh, still plenty of items listed. As I said, I've sold four, and obviously I'm going to be listing some more today. I've gained some followers on my store. Yesterday I had 139, now I've got 154. So if you're one of those followers, thanks for following my shop. I think if you go onto my shop and press this heart icon, uh, that means you can follow my shop, which means you can look it up. I think it's in Saved Sellers under your my ebay bit so you can go straight into my shop if you want to follow my uh, items uh, so yeah that's what i've still got listed so far and i'll show you what i've sold now so the first thing i sold was this james bond cd in fact this isn't a reselling item it's basically something i bought that i don't want don't tend to keep most of my cds i don't like buying digital so i buy a cd put it onto my itunes and then sell it off Hence the reason why I sold this. I sold it for $8.99, that was an offer. I was selling it for $9.99, but I thought $8.99 was quite reasonable, so I accepted that. So yeah, that was the first thing I sold. The next item I sold was a Star Wars figure, which I was really happy about. Again, it was sold on offer. This was $34.99. They offered $32, which I thought was pretty reasonable as an offer, so I accepted it. It's Kit Fisto. It's a Jedi. This one's starting to get uh, quite hard to get hold of, um, hence why it's uh, a premium price for a Black Series figure. So yeah, I'm really happy with that sale. The next item I sold, again, was a Star Wars figure. This one sold full price. Uh, it is a Death Star Trooper, uh, new and sealed. I have actually got another one of these, so I've literally just relisted it. Um, I have put it up for $19.99. It was a promoted item. I'm not promoting every single item, but this one I am promoting just because of the name. There's a Death Trooper from Rogue One, so it gets mixed up with those. So I thought if I promote it, it might highlight it a bit better in the search results. And it looks like it did because it sold. Uh, so yeah, I've relisted this for $19.99, my second copy. Uh, but yeah, this one sold full price, which I'm really happy about. And the final thing that I sold in the last 24 hours is this Star Trek Blu-ray box set. This is the 10 original movies, um, so the classic lineup plus the Next Generation lineup. Uh, basically, again, this isn't a reselling item. It's something out of my own collection um, that I've replaced. I've bought the Next Generation box set because I don't watch the classic ones, so I thought I'd sell this one. And yeah, it sold for $34.99. That's what I put it up for, so it sold full price. Uh, there's a bit of a story with this one. <laughs> Basically, yesterday evening, there was a guy messaging, well, not messaging me, but sending me offers. He started at 20 which I declined straight away because £15 um, discount is quite... Ridiculous. So, <laughs> started at 20, which I declined. He's offered 22. Again, I came back with a counter offer on that one that's at 32, uh, which he then counter offered at 25, and then he ran out of offers. Um, I declined the 25 because it's worth more than 25 pounds with free shipping. So, I stuck to my guns, and lucky a couple of hours later, um, this sold for full price. So, unfortunately, that other person lost out, and uh, this buyer got it for a good price. This is actually a good price for this set because I think it's actually deleted, or it's very hard to get hold of anyway. So, yeah, those are the four items that have sold in the last 24 hours. 
So I'm really happy that my eBay shop has got off to a good start. I think the uh, four sales total around 90, just over 90 pounds uh, before fees, which is pretty decent for a day's income, uh, compare it to a normal job. So I'm really happy about that. Uh, fingers crossed it carries on. Obviously I'm gonna be doing more listing today. Let me know in the comments down below what sort of videos you'd like to see from me. Would you like me to see me pick um, orders? I know some resellers do that on their channels. So when they ship in stuff, they'll go into the stock room and pick their orders and show you what's sold. Um, I'm quite tempted to do that kind of video. If that's something you'd be interested in, let me know. Also let me know if there's any other type of reselling videos you want to do. Um, the one video I will not be doing though is car boot and charity shop footage because I'm not comfortable filming the general public, like going around car boots and in the charity shops. And I need all my concentration on sourcing. <laughs> if I've got a camera in my hand, I'm not going to be 100% focused on sourcing items because I'll be very self-conscious about the camera. So unfortunately, that kind of video won't be on my channel. But if you want to see sales roundups, um, obviously I'll still be doing my hauls. I may even possibly try and put my foot into live streaming. I haven't done that for quite a long time and I did a couple back in the day. I think I did some Star Wars Destiny games live streaming, I can't remember. But yeah, I might go into live streaming, but I don't know if I've got a big enough audience to do that yet. So yeah, let me know in the comments any ideas and other than that guys, thanks for watching and I'll see you all soon in the next video. Take care, bye.